excuse me. Can I help you? Half a shilling. Bloody hell, where have you been till now? You should have been here ages ago to sound check. Sound check? <laughs> we don't sound check. We're a folk band. It comes from the heart. I will wear a social if it comes out the amp. <clears throat> Let's put the little subject one more time in. Here we go. Right. Five, six, seven, eight. Set, cross over, man. You get in it, you get in it. Cross, that's it. You cross, sit, and round. Follow me. Forward. That's it. Forward. And in the head. And stroke. Any minute, stroke. That's stroke. That's it. That's it. I think you've got it. I think that'll move. Fantastic. You picked it up. Brenda. Very good. Very good. Very good. <laughs> Always very mad. Follow me. See, I don't know if you know, love, but I'm disabled. I I've not got time to be buggering about with tape measures. All I know is it were big. That's why they call it a, a big screen. What part of big don't you get? And we had Sky, digital, the full it. Right, it's all gone. Don't. You see, that's what we got when we saw Karate Kid 1. And ever since then, it's been our dream to bring it to the stage through music. Forget two and three, they were crap. You see, inside, you're all karate kids. Because we're all Daniel Sands. You know that magic bit at the end? When he does the crane kick at the All Valley Under 18 Karate Championship and wins? And I'll tell you something, I'm choking up just thinking about this. Well, that's what we've got in front of us now. A chance to make magic. What are we going to do for costumes? Bin bags. Yeah, that's the one. Next to the dry cleaners. The pie shop. It's a front for the triads. The Yakuza. They live underground. Check the Battenberg for passports. <laughs> Any time, officer. Well, what are we going to do? I don't know, Jerry. I do not know. We need that licence for tonight. Can we, can, we, can we flick that thing off? We're in the shit here. Can we not reason with him? Keith Lard? You're joking. He's power mad, Leslie. He wants to destroy us. He's got it in for me. I used to have a supervisor, just like Lard, when I worked at Walker's. Right piece of work. We'd all book to go out at Christmas. We had a coach pick us up from the Albion. Three course meal, all in. Cheese board, coffee, mince, disco after. Anyway, he said we couldn't go, just like that. He wouldn't let us clock off early. He knew we'd had that book for months and all, and he made us clock off at our normal time. What did you do? Well, what can you do? We, we didn't go. We lost our deposits. At what point in this story do we get a fire licence? Eh? What? What a funny thing to take. Crates. That's all they took. It's crates, innit? They left the bottles, just took the bloody crates. Lunacy. Could have been the crate twins. No wonder this place is empty. People are too frightened to go out the bloody houses. Thou shalt love thy neighbour as thyself. Leviticus chapter 6, mm. verse 18. That's why we should have a singles night. Don't start this again, yeah. Jerry. Bring the community together through love. Oh, that's lovely, that's nice. Jerry, how deep's this barrel we're scraping? I'm telling you, there's a lot of lonely people out there. Don't oh, like it, Ellen or Rigby here. Hey, you've got to move with the times. They're all the rage. Yeah. He's right, right. right. You know, Jim McCoy's got one down the Vulcan. He's packed every week now. 650 on his back, guaranteed. You're all very keen. They're all very bloody keen, Marion. Mysterious are keen to get their oats. No, no it's not oh, that. You must think I'm slow. Oh, hang on. I'm happily married, man. Does Kathleen know? We've not even voted on it yet. No, it's a singles night. Have we agreed? All those in favour say aye. Aye, 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 aye. 
I say aye. Aye, it's my meeting. Aye, you say aye after I've said aye. All those in favour say aye. 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 Right. Now we'll have one. I'll give it a whirl. But we're not a brothel. Oh, I know. Right, we're not the banana groves, do you? Any more ideas or suggestions? Well, you, you know stars in your eyes? Well, I think they waste too much time singing on, on that programme. I reckon what they should do is they should bring them on and they say, tonight, Matthew, I'm going to be. Then they go off through the door, then they come back on dressed as who they're going to be, take a bow and then off, and then they bring the next one on. That way, if you, if you cut out a singing, you can get 10, 15 on each episode. At the moment, you're getting five, six tops. Right, I declare this meeting closed. Right. How would you know who's won? Plenty of gravy, flour. Mm, yes, lovely. That's the way. Sort of vinegar? Yeah, lo lots of salt and vinegar. Salt and vinegar. Next, please. Right. And it's like elastic. It goes boing. Right, hey, now with the raffle, I've got your ticket already in my hand, you see. So when I put it in, and then I pull it out, hey presto, you've won another prize. You see what I mean? You'd love a 12 inch, wouldn't you, as well? Colour television. <laughs> you dirty girl. You know, you know what I mean, hey? George Peppardi, he's straight in. You should him. He loves it when a plan comes together. Do you want to be in my gang? Piss off. Well. Right <laughs> Underground, overground, wombling free. Piss off. In the jungle, the mighty jungle, the lion sleeps tonight. Piss off. I don't. Women are toys. Women are human beings. You've got to treat them with respect. Treat them like ladies. How would you know? How would, uh, eh? how would I know? You have a lot to learn, young Jedi. You? You're on your ass off your pulse now. Are you going to take them back to your mums? the Volvo. Oh, ho, eh? Treat him like a lady. Rough ten minutes at back of his Volvo. Oh, all right, keep it down, eh? Don't tell me, tell him, or keep one been over here. Anyway, enough about me. What, what about you? Where do you live? Just outside Warrington. Warrington? Oh, oh well, I know Warrington very well. I'm our st old stomping ground, Warrington. Oh, many a good night. Cheap booze and dirty women. Yeah, I had many good time. We used to go to uh, the Carlton, Burtonwood. Yeah, yeah, we used to walk dances, twist. Um, uh, electric slide. Can't go back. Can't go back. Oh. Yeah. I think they want us to leave. They do. We've got to lock up. I've really enjoyed tonight. Yeah? Yeah, I wasn't going to come, but I thought it might be a bit... You know. No, I don't. No, different to be on to come. I want to. I'm glad you did. I want to run over your foot otherwise. <laughs> there is your foot. Is oh. I'll leave. Good, good. Very special treat, very special treat, a rare treat, and a rare wonderful player. The next up on the Jerry Oki tonight. It's Jerry Oki time. It's Ian, Jacko, and Mick, and they're going to be tub thumping. Come on!
sweet Jesus and the Holy Mother. Have you seen this? Have you seen this? Phone bill, £247 for that phone. But it's out of order. Oh, you're telling me it's out of order, Marion. Bloody bang out of order. It's supposed to be a pay phone. Guess who's playing? Bloody muggings here. I don't know none of these. Who are they? Ring them up. Look, this is wrong, this is. Someone's playing bloody games. There's a dialing tone. There's not. It's bloody working. Out of order. I'll bloody out of order him. Six million dollar man. He were a robot. No, he, he, six million, he, were, he were a bionic man. He were bionic. Bionic, aye. Bionic, that's bionic. it. Bionic. Yeah, that's right, yeah. The bionic man. Aye. Steve Austin. Steve Austin, that were him. He were, woo, all that, remember? What are you? He's here on telly, one of them chat shows of the days. Um, he's, not, he's a pensioner now, you know. Knocking on, he's got to have a hip replacement operation, he was saying to the woman. Does he? Mm. I'll cost him a few quid. Yeah. All right, Mr. Potter. I wonder when I found out you run off a 300 quid phone bill on a bloody pay phone that's supposed to be out of order. You don't know anything about it, do you? No, it's nothing to do with me. Yeah. They're international codes. Huh? Yeah. Well, 001. That's Canada. Canada? Yeah. And they reverse the charges, look. I reverse over them, cheeky swines. What's ASS? I don't know. Look, they're all that. Uh... Yeah, there's loads of calls to ass, look. Ass, 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 ass. The bloody half find that the ass will be grass and I'm gonna mow it. What's all this for? Robot wars, Pennine Suite. Good morning, young Kenneth. How's your grain? Still in Vancouver? Yeah. Good evening. My name's Mick Artistic. Take an Oxo from the Boxo and rub it soft against your skin. Feel the texture. Smell the gravy. Feel that dinner coming in. When you're hungry, when you're lonely, when it's Sunday, when it's supper time, get an oxo from the boxo and rub it soft against your skin. And if you listen, can hear tides of gravy rolling in across your Yorkshires, pushing mushrooms and bits of carrot off the edge. Off your plate. So when your girlfriend your boyfriend says it's over. And the words don't sink in. <coughs> Evening, ladies. Hiya. All right, Debbie. Hiya. Is you with Vicky? All right. Yeah, all right. Thanks. So I've been asking about her. All right. Yeah. Hello. Mm -hmm. Here you pop. That's it. Thanks. That's a ticket. Who were that? Debbie Farrell, that. I wrote her sister last night, Vicky. She's a rude girl. She bites. Where did you go? Nibblers. I didn't get in so far. Where were Murray? Revising. Well? What? Are you sorry? What for? Avoiding me. Hey, hey, what's brought all this on? I've not been avoiding you. It's because you've been busy. Revising. I called you last night. Uh, we're at the gym. Jazzercise Wednesdays, didn't get back till ten. I called you at half past. 
Early night, we're in bed. Couldn't hear the phone upstairs. You just don't seem bothered about me. Hey, I'm a busy boy. Come here. You're my girl. You're the one for me. <laughs> you know that. You can talk to me. What's up? Hmm? It's just that... Well, you never seem to have the time Shh. to... <coughs> you better off without him, love. Bin the tosser. <laughs> 